I just want you to focus Pull me in, pull me closer Give me that diagnosis Blow my mind like it's oceans Just one touch leaves me helpless On repeat like it's endless That she's turned to a white dress Looks so good, damn you did this, yeah I just want you to focus on my love Just focus on my I just want you to focus on my love Just focus on my I just want you to focus on my love Just focus on my Just focus on my Welcome back to another vlog. If you're new here, my name is Jacqueline Noel, and I post vlogs and videos about fashion, lifestyle, and beauty every week. So if you're interested in those things, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, all the things. So you guys saw me last night um, taking down my braids. As you can see, the hair is looking crazy right now, but that is because we're going to go get our hair done today. I'm so excited. So I actually got a haircut like back in like the beginning of june like end of may because i was going to get my braids put in and my ends just really needed a good trim so i actually got my hair cut not too long ago but today i'm gonna go and get like a full like scalp detox and actually have um, my hairdresser cut my hair curly because my curly hair it's it's healthy but the shape of it is like very square and just not cute so i'm gonna see if she can just like work on the shape a little bit um i'm really hoping i don't end up with like a bowl cut and i really don't want bangs so We'll see how it comes out but before that um, i have to run to the doctor's office really quick and then we're gonna go get our hair done and then we are going to go get some groceries because i've been eating out way too much and i need to start cooking at home i'm trying to be like on a health kick this month because last month i was traveling a lot and i was eating terribly so i'm really trying to focus on eating clean even though y'all saw me eat some ice cream last night let's just ignore that it was a long week um but anyway i'm already running behind so that's what we're doing today uh, and i have on my new bottega sunglasses so even though i look a mess i feel like because i have my new sunnies on it pulls all together so like by the time my hair is done and everything she's gonna be looking like a baggie again okay so i'm not usually an ice drink girl but i recently started like trying out iced chai tea lattes so that's what i get from starbucks and you know what i'm not mad at it like i get the whole like little aesthetic thing because it's cute um but i think they're actually pretty good for like a midday drink like i wouldn't get this in the morning because i prefer hotter drinks in the morning but anyway you guys um so wrapped up at the doctor's office got some starbucks and now i am at my hair appointment to get this hair taken care of because it's looking rough um like i said i'm getting a curly cut and i'm super excited so hopefully it comes out good but you guys are gonna see all of that so let's go just finishing up getting my hair done you guys saw i got um like a scalp treatment i got my hair washed um obviously got like a wash and go and then i got my hair cut and i'm very happy with it um the girl who does my hair her name is paris at paris the artist on instagram i'll tag her um she does a great job with my hair but let me tell you guys something having curly hair is like the most frustrating experience of my life so i don't know if you guys could tell in the video but before I got my hair cut when I was sitting underneath the dryer, you could really see like how uneven my hair looked. And my hair is not actually uneven at all. Like when I get it blow dried and stuff, it's super straight. Or it's not super straight, it's very even. Um, but because of like just how my hair is or for whatever reason, like this side of my hair does not curl the same way this side does. So, oh, all these notifications on my phone. Anyway, 
so if you guys can tell like this side is like super curly all the way from the root all the way down and then this side is like just like more wavy like it almost gives like the perception of like if i had heat damage on my hair but i don't have heat damage because i don't use heat on my hair and it just doesn't curl the same way so like before she went through and like shaped out my hair a little bit more like literally this side was like hanging down here and this side was just up here so now it's not even anymore because i just told her to cut it so like we cut this piece to here and this piece is down here which honestly it's fine like i don't care because um i wear my hair curly all the time anyway but yeah it's literally just like this top fourth of my hair because underneath it like these curls are fine they're they work they're good they're functional they're with the program it's just this top piece of my hair that just does not cooperate so i just told her like i was like you know what just cut it like i don't care if it's if it's uneven because i don't ever wear my hair straight so i don't know i'm gonna have to like really just focus on like keeping my hair moisturized on this side particularly and like focus like my hair masks and stuff on this side and she was even suggesting that i like maybe try to do like a side part instead of a middle part just for the time being but all this to say like even if you think you're doing like all the right things to keep your hair healthy not using heat doing your mess and stuff it can still get messed up which is so frustrating so frustrating but overall i'm really happy with it we really were working on like just taking away the boxy shape of my hair so that when it starts to grow it grows in more of um just like a better shape because before it was just like very boxy so right now it's pretty flat just because we didn't like separate out the curls but i'm sure by tomorrow it'll be like very big and full of volume but overall really happy with it and now we're gonna go over to costco so i can get some groceries and then trader joe's and then we're gonna head home so i got a costco membership probably like a year ago and honestly i don't even know if i should keep it because i actually only come to, co to costco to buy like three things and that's to get um my salmon i buy grapes here because i feel like the price of grapes at the regular grocery store is way too expensive and then just like maybe cereal and some snacks which like is that worth the subscription every year i don't know but i'm gonna keep it because if anything the fruit is always good at costco so i'm looking to see if i can find the seafood section you know there's like not a lot of like aisle labels at stores like this um so we're looking for seafood and fruits, and then we're gonna go to Trader Joe's. We are back from running errands, going to the grocery store, and I just picked up some Chipotle. My hair looks so short, you guys. Here it is in good light. This is how it looks. It's still like long and short. But the shape does look a lot better. Um, so I'm just gonna like do the nourishing like she said and hopefully it gets with the program because it's really just this one piece right up here. Um, I'm gonna do a quick haul to show you guys what I got at Trader Joe's though. Okay, so here are the groceries from Trader Joe's. I picked up these organic white corn tortilla chips. Then I also am going to try the vegan pesto i heard it's really good and i like pesto so i actually want to make like a pesto salmon and then i got um some feta cheese to really just to add on salads um always get the japanese style fried rice it's the bomb um and then i actually got another thing of salmon just because i like to put the salmon on the stove and the other one in the oven so i got some salmon to put on the stove um then i also got some snap peas just to snack on because like I said I'm trying to eat a little bit healthier this month um and then also grab my favorites which are some nectarines from Trader Joe's so that's it and I forgot to mention when I was at Trader Joe's y'all this is why you never pick up the first like of any product so I was looking at the nectarines um to put them in my cart and this man literally was opening up everything of like the fruit next to it putting his whole face into it like nose and everything to smell it and i was just like sir you're putting your nose onto the fruit that people are going to pick up and eat never pick up the top one y'all never pick up the top one 
All right, you guys, so it is later in the night and I am about to just relax for the rest of the day. So I'm gonna end this mini spend the day with me vlog right here. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and if you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, comment down below as well as subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys next time.